Share Tribe Tutorial for Beginners. Hi guys, this is Speak About Digital and welcome to this video tutorial on how to use Share Tribe. Share Tribe is a powerful platform that enables you to create and manage your own online marketplace with ease. Whether you're looking to buy, sell, or offer services, Share Tribe provides all the tools you need to build a successful marketplace and connect with users around the world. In this tutorial, we'll guide you through the basics of ShareTribe, including the process of setting up your marketplace, adding listings, and exploring additional features. We have a lot to cover in this video, so let's get started with the tutorial. To begin using ShareTribe, the first step is to create an account. You will find the link down below in the description, so go to the description of this video and click on the first link you find there. This will take you to the correct homepage. Once you're on the homepage, look for the Start Building for Free button and click on it. This action will redirect you to another page where you'll be prompted to choose a plan for your marketplace. ShareTribe offers two plans, ShareTribe Go and ShareTribe Flex. ShareTribe Go is priced at $79 per month and comes with a 30-day free trial. ShareTribe Flex, on the other hand, costs $299 per month. For the purpose of this tutorial, we'll select the ShareTribe Go plan. To proceed, click on the Start a Free 30-Day Trial option. Upon clicking, you'll be directed to a page where you'll need to set up your account details. Provide your email address, first name, and last name, and create a strong password. Once you've completed this step, click on the Next Marketplace Details button to continue. In the next phase, you'll be required to create a marketplace. Choose the type of marketplace you want to create, specify its name, select your country, and choose the desired language. After filling in these details, click on the Take Me to My Go Marketplace button. It may take some time to create your marketplace. Once the process is complete, you'll be directed to the admin panel of your newly created marketplace. From here, you can begin customizing and managing your marketplace according to your preferences and needs. Once you access the admin panel of your ShareTribe marketplace, you'll notice a left menu known as the admin menu. This menu contains essential tabs that enable you to effectively manage your marketplace activities and settings. If you ever require assistance, you can easily reach out to the support team through the chat feature located in the bottom right corner of the panel. The first tab in the admin menu is Home. This section provides you with an overview of your marketplace, allowing you to access Quick Links and Marketplace Academy resources and quickly upgrade your account if needed. Moving on to the General tab, you'll find various settings related to the general configuration of your marketplace. Within this tab, you can manage essentials such as your domain, privacy settings, static content, and admin notifications. These settings allow you to tailor your marketplace according to your specific requirements. The Design tab is where you can unleash your creativity and design your marketplace's appearance. This tab is divided into sections such as logos and color, cover photos, landing page, top bar, footer, and arrangement. Clicking on each section within the Design tab, you'll be directed to the respective customization options. ShareTribe provides a user-friendly interface that simplifies the design process, allowing you to easily and intuitively design each section of your marketplace according to your preferences. Under the Users tab, you have access to the user management functionalities. Here you can manage users, define user fields to gather specific information during signup, configure signup and login options, set user rights and permissions, and view and manage user invitations. The Listing tab is dedicated to managing your listings. Here you have the ability to create categories to organize your listings effectively. Additionally, you can manage listing fields to capture relevant information, control the listing approval process, and handle listing comments to ensure smooth communication and interactions. Moving on to the Transactions and Reviews tab, this section provides you with tools to oversee your marketplace's transactions and reviews. You can view and manage ongoing conversations between users, handle reviews left by buyers and sellers, and configure transaction settings to facilitate seamless and secure transactions within your marketplace. The Payment System tab allows you to manage the payment system of your marketplace. Here, you can configure settings related to the country and currency in which your transactions will take place. Additionally, you can set a minimum listing price to ensure reasonable pricing and customize the payment settings for popular payment gateways like PayPal and Stripe, making it convenient for users to transact securely. In the Emails tab, you have the ability to manage your marketplace's email communications. You can compose and customize various types of emails, such as welcome emails for new users, automatic newsletters to keep users engaged, and specify a custom outgoing email address for consistent branding and communication. 
The Search and Location tab allows you to manage the search functionality and location settings of your marketplace. This tab enables you to fine-tune the search capabilities, ensuring that users can easily find the listings that they are looking for. You can also manage location-related features to enhance the accuracy of location-based searches and provide a seamless user experience. The Social Media tab provides you with tools to manage the social media presence of your marketplace. Within this section, you can customize the image and tags associated with your marketplace when shared on social media platforms. Additionally, you can integrate your marketplace with Twitter, enabling social media interactions and engagement. Social share buttons can also be configured to facilitate the easy sharing of listings and content across various social media platforms. Under the SEO tab, you have the ability to optimize your marketplace for search engines. Here, you can perform SEO-related tasks such as generating sitemaps and configuring the behavior of search engine crawlers through the robots.txt file. Furthermore, you can customize meta tags for your landing page and search pages, improving the visibility and ranking of your marketplace in search engine results. The Analytics tab allows you to manage the analytics of your marketplace. You can integrate Google Analytics, a powerful tool for tracking and analyzing user behavior, website traffic, and conversion rates. Additionally, you can set up Google Tag Manager, which provides advanced tracking and management of tags and scripts on your marketplace. The Advanced tab offers additional functionalities for advanced customization and management. Here, you can manage custom scripts to add specific functionalities or integrations to your marketplace. You can also explore and enable new features released by ShareTribe. Additionally, you have the option to configure reCAPTCHA, a security measure that helps protect your marketplace from spam and abuse. Lastly, if you needed, you can also delete your marketplace from this tab. Now, let's see how to post a new listing to your marketplace. A listing in ShareTribe represents items, facilities, or services available for buying, selling, booking, or offering on a marketplace. Listings contain various fields that provide detailed information, including price, description, location, and category. In the following video tutorial, we will demonstrate how to add a listing to your marketplace. To begin posting a new listing, navigate to the top right corner of the ShareTribe platform and click on Go to your marketplace. This action will direct you to your marketplace's interface where you can add a new listing. If you have already added listings to your marketplace, they will be displayed for you to view in grid, list, or map format. To add a new listing, click on the plus post a new listing button. This will take you to another page where you need to select the type of listing. ShareTribe offers two types, offering without online payment and offering with online payment. For this tutorial, we will focus on adding a listing without online payment. After selecting the listing type, a new window will open where you can choose the category for your listing. You also have the option to change the listing type if needed. Once you have made your selections, enter the title of the listing in the Listing Title field and specify the price in the Price field. Additionally, provide a detailed description of the listing. Next, enter the location of the listing in the Location field. As you enter the location, it will be displayed on the map beneath the field. You can also upload an image of the listing to enhance its visual appeal. Once you have filled in all the necessary fields, click on the Post Listing button to publish the new listing on your marketplace. Upon successfully posting the listing, it will be displayed in your marketplace for potential users to view and engage with. And there you have it, a beginner's guide to using ShareTribe. You can sign up using the first link in the description. I appreciate that, thank you. We hope you found this video helpful in understanding the key features and functionalities on the platform. With ShareTribe, you have the power to create and manage your online marketplace, opening up endless opportunities for buying, selling, and offering services. So again, if you found this video helpful, please give me a thumbs up, and if you have any questions at all, please comment below. I try to answer all the comments the best I can. Thanks for watching.